of your bra, slow down, grab yourself a beer as we head 50 miles northwest of Walgett to Grawen in New South Wales, where we free camp at the Club in the Scrub, check out the sights and eat at the world famous Glengarry Hilton. We're in Walgett, we are going up through Kambora up to Gruen and it's a dirt road out here, we're a couple of kilometres or so, to the oak oh. fields and we're going to go to Pub in the Scrub. Okay, so and what's, we'll turn it over. what's Pub in the Scrub? Well there's three pubs. So it's not pub in the scrub, it's pubs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so first one is up here, club in the scrub. And that's so where we're going to stay. We'll probably camp there. There's a golf course, there's a general store, fuel, there's mug, mugs, carvings out here. You've got a shed there's, around, I think. Um, we might even go to the Hilton for lunch, babe. How'd you like that? Take you to the Hilton for lunch. Hi. We've got Ned's Corner, I don't know what's there. We've got the uh, War Memorial, be interesting to look at. Pub. Sheep Yard. Pub. Pub. Yeah. And a bit of dirt road driving. And just one question. What? Are you going to pay for the meal at the Hilton? Uh, you got the money, honey. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'll shout you. Uh, you'll you shout at me. I'll shout you, you pay. How's <laughs> that? Is that a fair me. deal? No. <laughs> you want to hit the road? Yeah. Here we are at uh, the pub in the scrub. There's um, three pubs out in this area. So we're just gonna go and have a little look around and uh, see what there is to see here. A bit quirky. There's a donation bin there. And here we are at Club in the Scrub with the endless books you can borrow and that humour in the signs posted all over different places. These pubs really like to give you something to laugh about and make you feel right at home. Check out this billiard table, especially made up to light up the Club in the Scrubs logo. This is not your typical pub, or well, maybe it is. I think that all pubs should have a designated beer and bullshit area. What do you think? There's a great outdoor area for the kids, animals, and times to relax for a beer. Camping at the pub is free. We think that we found the best area there. Check it out. And the shell and fig to watch out for us too. So I've been doing a little bit of noodling here. Just um, look and see if I can see any colour. This is outside the uh, pub in the scrub. And I dump this here for people to look through. There buses coming and uh, doing tours from Lightning Ridge. This is my little spot I've been uh, digging in here. Haven't really um, come across too much. I had a spray bottle here yesterday with a bit of uh, and a little bit of a uh, potch. But um, haven't seen any colour here at all. And the only thing I did find was. Um, I'll show you what a bit of potch is, but um, let's get this in the camera. So you can, I don't know if you can see that little, little sort of opaque blue line through there. That is potch, which is a sign that this could be opal, but you know, I just uh, opened it up and you can see there there's no sign of any opal there, but um, you can see where the seam runs through. That's about all I've found so far, so gotta keep looking, I guess. I'm gonna go for a little bit of a drive and see if I can find another spot. Corrugation 
contest. Here we are at the world famous Glengarry Hilton. And there is a warning here making train traces of nuts. And if you want to know why it's world famous, it's because it says so up there. This is Gil's idea of the Hilton. The decor was amusing, the locals were friendly, the grog was good, and the meals, well, make sure you have plenty of room as they were huge. You can also park up a tent, a van or motorhome and stay here. It's unpowered and it's spread over two hectares. Here we are at the sheep yards. Just going to have a bit of a look around, so swing the camera around a bit and see what we can see. Sheepyard Pub also has free accommodation and lot. Okay, check out the price of fuel over here. Uh, two seventy a litre. Diesel, unlimited, unlimited. Only one. Okay, to wrap it up, we set up camp at Club in the Scrum, and that's because it was only a couple of k's of dirt road to get there. You can camp at the other spots as well, but you can also do a day trip from Walgett. Lightning Ridge and you'd be able to see everything in a day. For attractions we thought Sheepyard Inn was probably the pick of the bunch um, but they were all worth seeing. As far as food goes, can't go past the Hilton, Glengarry Hilton, huge meals. We also had, had a meal at um, Burger at Club in the Scrub that was great as well. Uh, Sheepyard Inn was basically sold out of everything by the time we got there. So we can't really comment on that. I'm going to make Gil tell you the tips, but he's, <laughs> he's going to read them because we, this, we haven't got a day to film. <laughs> Tip number one is fill up with fuel when you see it at a reasonable price because when we were at Burke it was nearly $2.08 per litre for diesel. So when we got to Growin it was $2.70 per litre. Tip number two, I don't always rely on the map. So we got a map from an information centre in Tuggamar in Victoria and when we got to Yarrawonga they told us that they were using old maps. So that was one lesson that we learned. And then when we got a map from Walgett Information Centre and we got to Grawen, they told us that this, if this map was incorrect because the actual fork in the road to the pubs, it actually showed on our map that it didn't, you had to go down one road and then the other and where really it actually goes in, in a loop. So they meet. And tip number three, don't always rely on your GPS, especially if you have a 200 series Toyota. 
because our GPS has taken us numerous times in circles, down dead end streets and on unplanned mystery tours. It happens too often. Often We are looking at upgrading our GPS to an Apple CarPlay. So, oh. <laughs> so to keep my sanity, <laughs> please subscribe <laughs> because I need to book myself into a loony home. <laughs> Going out of my mind. <laughs> um, oh, you can, if you if you like our videos. Yeah. Yeah, you like it. Leave a comment though. And subscribe. Yeah. Please. Please subscribe. Because I really do have to go into a living home. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Bye. Right. Next week, come with us to Lightning Ridge, New South Wales, fifty-five minutes drive from Grawan where we stayed at Lawn Station Caravan Park, home of John Murray Art Gallery, where the neighbours are friendly, the locals have a sense of humour, and the sights are plentiful. You can catch the moon or a sunrise. You take my breath and I can't get it back. Might be time for me to face the facts. The best me is with you, but I know I got a lot to prove.